Obtaining a urine specimen involves the collection of the like for laboratory analysis and may be the first step in determining a diagnosis and treatment. There are different types of urine specimen collection. We are now about to introduce the procedures of three of the following. First is midstream clean catch specimen. Step 1. Thoroughly wash hands with soap and water. Separate the skin folds around the urinary opening. Wash area with a soap pad or towel using front-to-back motion. Step 3. Begin urinating with skin folds held apart with fingers. Collect the midstream urine. Make sure to avoid touching the skin area. Fill half of the container and remove from the stream. Step 4. Cover the container and screw the lid tightly. Step 5. Properly label the container, taking into consideration the information needed. Step 6. Refrigerate the specimen until it is ready for transport to the laboratory. Next is pediatric specimen. Step 1. Wet hands with water. Apply enough soap to cover all hand surfaces. Rub hands palm to palm. Right palm over left dorsum with interlaced fingers and vice versa. Palm to palm with fingers interlaced. Backs of fingers to opposing palms with fingers interlocked. Rotational rubbing of left palm clasp in right palm and vice versa. Rotational rubbing backwards and forwards with clasped fingers of right hand in left palm and vice versa. Rinse hands with water. Dry thoroughly with a single-use towel. Use towel to turn off faucet and your hands are safe. Step 2. Use povidone iodine swabs to clean the urethral area. Step 3. Place sterile urine bag over labia and penis. Step 4. Reclean and replace urine bag if no urine in 30 minutes. Step 5. Empty bag into a sterile container. Lastly, is 24 hour or time specimen. On day 1, urinate into the toilet when you get up in the morning. Afterward, collect all urine in a special container for the next 24 hours. On day 2, Urinate into the container when you get up in the morning. Cap the container, keep it in the refrigerator or a cool place during the collection period. Label the container with your name, the date, the time of completion, and return it as it is drafted.